for the sake of a demo because I know it seems like everyone's pressed for some time as always. There's a lot of cool things here. Basically, I'm just going to go ahead here. Because we do have someone from my hometown of Cleveland, I'm going to print a picture that's been on my phone for over a year because until now there was no way to conveniently print and share in the moment, let alone at home. So I'm going to go ahead. This is just a regular Motorola phone. No software updates, no firmware bought right off the shelf. And right here is a picture of me and my friends at the Cleveland Cavaliers game with one of the Cleveland Browns players. I'm simply just going to go to my options menu, send via Bluetooth. It will temporarily turn on the Bluetooth and automatically find the printer. As you can see, it's found two printers, which means there are two printers powered on within the range. Each printer does have its own unique name, but as well as password protected. I'm going to go ahead and select and sync. As you can see, the phone is already connected. In less than five seconds, this 1.3 megapixel image will be copied and sent from my phone. The phone is already disconnected and my work is done. For the sake of the demo, I'll talk you through what the printer is experiencing. The LED is communicating that it has received the image wirelessly and is rendering. If you listen closely, the printer has powered on. Because there is no ink, there is 200 billion colorless dye crystals that are now getting passed under 200 million heat pulses that are activating, delivering a product that not only is <clears throat> unaffected by gravity, but go ahead and sort of brush your finger on that. Unlike your inkjet, there's virtually no time to dry. As I promised, in less than 60 seconds, an image that has been on my phone for over a year has been fully activated and ready to share. What also makes these prints extremely unique is they are very durable, so they are tear resistant as well as water resistant. So if you were to spill water on it, unlike your ink jets that would bleed, simply wipe off or wipe on your sleeve and you have not lost any of your image quality. Lastly, because we are Polaroid, we're a fun, innovative company. We have added a peel off sticky back applications. So everyone who feels unfortunate to not have the Cleveland experience, people like Steve st still have the exact same experience that I had over a year ago. Okay. The printer will be available in the U.S. this fall with a suggested retail price of $149. Because there is no ink, there is no hidden cost, so what you pay for the paper is what you get for price per print. The suggested retail price will average roughly 30 to 35 cents per print. So if you do the math, the 10-pack could retail for as low as $2.99, making it very affordable for all demographics. Two of the largest complaints we have from the instant technology that we've built our company on in the past 70 years was one that it cost way too much to print. Currently, our instant film is costing somewhere between $8 and $12 for a 10-pack. As you can see here with this new unique zinc technology, we have caught, cost, caught the cost in third. Secondly, with the instant technology, if you guys have all used an instant camera, I'm sure you have, if you're clumsy like me and you go to take a picture, and you happen to sneeze or move your hand too quick, guess what, that flash is going off, four seconds later you're going to have an instant print and it's going to look nothing like a flash ghost. Unfortunately, because you had, did not have the opportunity to review it, you just wasted a dollar of your, of, your, of your own personal money as well as four seconds of your own time. What's great about this product, it really de delivers the instant, spontaneous experience that we founded the company on, and it just happens to be on our 70th anniversary. We develop a very unique product, delivers the exact same experience for the digital age.